Hey everyone, uh, my name is Calvin and welcome to my little iPad video tutorial here. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the mockups that come with my watercolor for Procreate add-on. So just download that zip file like normally, just the normal watercolor for Procreate and uh, download it onto your iPad and then open up your file browser and then just locate wherever it was you saved that zip file. For me, I saved it over here and uh, it'll let you preview the content like that and just swipe until you see the uh, mockups and then you can share that with Procreate to open it. Okay, it'll look just like this for watercolor mockups. So I'll open that one up. And uh, if you go to the layers panel, you can turn off that default artwork and then just select a different scene. Just turn all the scenes off and then just turn the one on that you wanna use. So this one, that one, um, I think for this video, I'll use this one. I really like the simple style. And uh, I'll go over to the wrench and I'll do uh, add, insert a photo. And then I'll just insert one of my uh, recent watercolor paintings here. And I just uh, exported it without the background. So make sure you watch the original main tutorial for this add-on, because uh, at the very end of it, I show you how to save your watercolor with just a pure white background. So it's placed now in the mock-up. I just need to go to the layers panel again, and then set the transparency of your little watercolor uh, image here to multiply. Uh, and then you can use the arrow, the arrow tool here to move it around, kind of scale it a little bit better. And uh, once you're happy with the uh, placement there, you can export it just like normally. Just go to the little wrench, do share, and then uh, JPEG, and then save image. So hopefully that's a, a quick little overview about how to use the mockups that come with this. Uh, I may add more mockups uh, in the future, but uh, the process is still exactly the same. If you have any questions or comments, you can leave a comment on this video or just send me an email directly. But uh, other than that, guys, thank you so much for your support and thanks for watching.